The goals for the season is typical. We want to win a championship. It's simple. Uh, we want to win a championship first by going through the C2C, uh, put ourselves in a position going to the playoffs as, as the number one seed. Uh, this year, the championship is at Mary Washington, so we're going on the road. Uh, we're looking forward to the opportunity and then also put us in a position to compete in the NCAA tournament. Yeah, so we're all just trying to be the best versions of ourselves. Our goal is to win the C2C and compete for a national championship. So that being said, we want to have a clean sheet. We need to shut out every single game. We want to score goals. And right now we are just trying to find those people that will set us up the best. Well, this past spring, I was really uh, pleased with our uh, leadership. We, we actually went through a book called the Leadership Manu Manual. And we had all our players participate. Um, and I saw growth. I saw some vulnerabilities that we, we showed. And I also saw, saw some growth in our, in our leadership style. And I, it's nice to see our players apply that to their summer, to their big sister program, um, to their accountability piece through, through the summer and staying in communication with each other. And also having some empathy for their, for their fellow teammates as well as incoming freshmen. So we have like a big sister, little sister, so we have a lot of people stepping up and being showing the underclassmen the type of resources that they need to succeed here at Salisbury. Well, for me, that again, that's simple. Um, they, they became C2C all-conference players for a reason, and that's through hard work, uh, their soccer IQ, and also the players around them. So they understand that it's not just what they did last season, it's what the players will allow them to do as far as their support. So we're going to build on that and you know yes we lost uh, two players also but i think that the players that we have returning will support them and you'll probably see some new all-conference faces at the end of the season you know it's not about filling filling in gaps I mean, we we have some players returning that will step up uh, and and share their new version of what we're trying to do uh, we have some younger players coming in that definitely will give us some depth in those positions but i think the returners have set their own path. Each team is different, and I'm excited to see our, our returners and our, and our leaders take a new role and take us on a new path. The sophomores, the juniors, the seniors, everybody has really rallied around the incoming freshmen. We have all stepped up into leadership roles, just making sure those 16 players are the best versions of themselves. I've been pleased. The energy's been great, right? That's the one thing we can control. And we constantly minister to our players that they control the controllables, um, look to be uncomfortable, because that's when we learn. So the energy rate's been there, the training mentality has been there. Uh, I've seen a lot of mentorship within our older players to our younger players, whether or not it's tactically, mentally, how to get through things. Uh, we had even, uh, as recently of retaking our, our fitness test, um, our leadership decided that everyone's going to redo it. They weren't pleased with the results, but they also wanted to support everyone and going forward, so as a staff, we thought that was an amazing idea coming from our leadership and we supported it. So the mentorship to building our culture and building our chemistry has been amazing so far this preseason. From the spring coming into the summer, there's been no let up. Um, the energy's high, the effort's high, and um, overall, it's, it's good to be around everyone. I think every game that we look at is a stepping stone to what we want to do. And we're trying to build a program that is sustainable we're trying to build a program that allows our kids to grow mentally and physically. And we're trying to build a program that will be contending for national championships yearly.